so I just got back from the first night of theater under the gun and tonight is Friday and this weekend I'm going to be filming the process of putting together a 10 minute short play and performing it live so I'm gonna start off by showing you footage of tonight and I'll check back in tomorrow to see some more of this chaotic adventure That's good. How are you doing? <laughs> In retrospect, what we should have said when he asked us why we had the chainsaw was because that we wanted to see what other companies would do with that material. Or because we're cutting edge. Thank you, proud, So I saw Sam earlier, and I think he's a bit tired. I like when I was writing it. I understood that he's gonna change it. I hope he doesn't. He's gonna change a lot. But I hope he doesn't keep, I keep the animal pun. I, keep, I hope he keeps at least a little bit. Of it. Yeah, like, like it took a long time. Yeah. We're going very dark. I'm looking forward to how Pat's gonna finesse it and add some dark comedy, which I think is gonna be really cool. And I like how we're gonna use the orbs as um, some animal eyes. I think that's gonna look really cool. Uh, basically, the moral is about animal cruelty and how animals are forced to be tested on and perform circuses and everything. And I think that's just terrible. So we want to get the point across that whether it's still going on, it's always going to be going on, and we need to do something about it to change it. Kind of pissed off with a few people, yeah. But I mean, it's otherwise everything's great, you know. I kind of need five more cups of coffee and I need to eat a whole buffet to myself, but other than that, I think it's fun. Compared to last year, you're definitely making more progress at this point. Last year, it was a lot more rewriting and many crazy ideas going around, but we have a pretty clear idea of what's happening this year. So, I feel like there's going to be a little less stress involved. Um, I hope he keeps the beginning because I think the beginning is really solid with all the different performances. That, I think that was the most fun part to write. It's really underdeveloped, but it's going to be good. I think with the basis that we have, I think once Pat develops it, it's going to be really good. So, so far what we've done today is we all met and we all wrote down our, all of our ideas for what, like, the sound cue and the prop and the lighting and what everything meant to us. And then we kind of like narrowed our ideas down to like what a storyline could be or what the moral of the story could be. And I thought that was a really good idea because then like you have a clear image. I wanted to focus on sort of like 
how circuses or how like zoos and stuff treat animals poorly or how there's animal cruelty in like makeup testing on animals. So that's basically like how we came up with the premise of our script. I think it'll turn out pretty good if we can get like if we can get the moral across at the end, like I feel like that's the most important thing. Do you like the wall? I do like the wall. But uh, all I have to say is that this is a nice feeling wall. Where? Probably my unit. <laughs> <laughs> So right now we're heading into the costume room and we're trying to find some animals. Right now we have a bunny. Uh, what other animals do we have? Uh, an eagle and... I grabbed a tiger thing but I'm not sure if we're going to yeah. use that. And then... Uh, a horse. A horse. Okay, that's, that's going to be so funny though if we have a horse riding a human. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Like, can you just imagine that? Just like having a horse riding a human. That would be amazing. I am Bunny. It's a very psychotic character. I will be playing the Barker and the Eagle. My name is Rupert. I'm a man. My character's name is Elsa Beth. I'm a rat. Good. I know, it's great. It's I think I really like our costumes because we took a bunch of different pieces of several costumes and then put them together to make new ones. Today went pretty good. There wasn't many conflicts. The whole idea came together really well. And I think everyone's happy with the final product we have right now. So yeah. We came a long way from the very beginning. We just had a bunch of ideas and I think the characters have really developed a lot. And I think it's a really good message and uh, it's going to be a really dramatic play for uh, everyone in the audience. Well, we obviously need to work on the tech and get everything like that organized and uh, hopefully everyone does get off book, which I think will because there's not that many lines for anyone. I think it went really well. I had a lot of fun. We now have all of our costumes done, which is really good. And now we're just like working on props and blocking and other stuff. Come look at the freaks. Come gape at the geeks. I drew a full crow. Let's listen to that. There is no cause for alarm. Our human pets and beasts of food are under our control. We give you our resident ball. Close to my heart. Never to part. Performing today for your entertainment. Yes! Yeah, they escaped! Run! Run! We have everyone has their mind memorized and it's just I feel it's gonna go really good. And we're gonna get everything. Uh, proper with all the music, everything is just going to run really smoothly and just going to be really clean and polished. I'm really excited for that tip. So we're leaving for tech soon and everyone's just cleaning up and I think everyone has all the lines memorized and stuff. Um, the only thing is like we have some cues that we need to figure out and different tech things that obviously we're going to be doing in tech but we only have like a limited amount of time for that so it's going to be kind of stressful because we only have an hour. But hopefully it will go good and then our performance is in a couple hours. So yeah.
everyone else doing? <laughs> hey. yeah, just... I want to see everyone in their costumes. <laughs> Okay, so let's see. We have our show order of Kaleidoscope. Yeah. Who's next after Kaleidoscope? Yeah. So we finished the show, and now I'm heading home I'm in the car. And everyone did so amazing. And there was a lot of great performances. There were six different performances. And they were all so like different and original and I loved them all. Everyone in Kaleidoscope did so amazing. I was so like impressed about how well the, the show got pulled together. And yeah, so I just wanted to give a huge thank you to everyone in my acting class for letting me film them all weekend. And yay, theater under the gun. It was awesome. So I'll see you sometime soon. Bye. You. What do you want? How do you feel it's now? It's over. Getting out of here. We're going away. Bye. Wait.